Automotive Systems, located in beautiful downtown Auburn, is a different kind of custom PC shop. From oil submerged system kits to thermal imaging and custom benchmarking, they're raising the bar when it comes to building a personalized piece of computing machinery. But one of the most interesting things about this shop is their inclusion and equal billing of Linux operating systems. On both their homepage and when building a custom PC, Linux distros maintain a position of respect. We had the opportunity to speak with founder and president of Puget Systems, John Bach, on this topic. We build systems with no operating system. We build systems with, with Linux. We offer Ubuntu. You offer, Linux. you offer OpenOffice too, as uh -huh. a, which is great. Mm -hmm. how's, the re, how's the demand been? Is there, is there people, do people know what Ubuntu is? Are people looking yes. for it? Yeah, yeah. Well, I think in the fact that we do mark it, like you, like you said on our homepage, I think some people specifically find us when we're searching for Ubuntu computers. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, to us, it's just about um, we want to provide all different different selections. Uh, we actually are limited in our support ability of the Linux operating system, so it's a trade-off for us. So on the one hand, we're not earning you know the margin we would have by selling an operating system, which is very small. Uh, but then on the other hand, we're also not providing as great extent of, of technical support. Right. So really, it, it's, uh, we're weekly happily either way. Do you have any uh, machines here in the house that run Ubuntu, other than just for support purposes? Like, do you have some people that sometimes boot into Ubuntu to? Yeah, uh, well, uh, I don't think any of our office computers do, but a good number of our build workstations uh, that really just are a web interface where our builders check off as they do things. And oh, it's perfect for that. Yeah, it is. Do you have any people buying the no operating system option? Yeah, uh, customers that... Or maybe already own a copy exactly, of Windows. Or... Exactly, that, and they want to buy again. And actually what we do is we uh, we go ahead and install Windows 7 without a key, and that works that way for 30 days. Oh, so we still do all of our nice. testing, and we run through all of our benchmarks and thermals, um, and then we just wipe it before we send it out. Well, it's, it's come a long way. I, I actually had the first time uh, the, the other month where um, I couldn't do what I needed to do in Windows, so I had to load Linux to do really? it. Really? And it works. Mm -hmm. so, we have we have a couple of physical servers here that are uh, VMware ESXi, and they're all running a bunch of virtual servers, you know, serving our everything from our security cameras to internal cool. internal NAS systems, and mm -hmm. every single one of them is running Ubuntu server. That's cool. On the next installment of the Computer Action Show's road trip to Puget Systems, we uncover the high tech methods they use to test the systems before they hit the road, and we kind of uncover exactly what it takes and what it means to build a gaming machine. <laughs>